Today, we are getting the Salt Morningstar. This is a rare tier 3 weapon that is extremely powerful. What it lacks in damage, it makes up for in stun capability. This item takes a bit to obtain, but is worth the extra effort. So how do you get it? This is RCSU. If you like any of the things listed on the screen, please subscribe. Before you seek out the recipe for this weapon, there's some preparation that you should probably do. My recommendation would be to go to the sandbox, get on the edge, whether by building up to it or riding the zipline from the picnic table, and kill some antlions to get the antlion armor. This is useful as you'll be able to spend more time in the sandbox. Perks of having the whole set are a severely slowed rate of the sizzling effect. A good way of killing some antlions is to equip a bow, or crossbow, which is my choice, and venture into the sand. Once you have the attention of one, run back up to right here and get back up on the ledge. Do not go any further to the right or the antlion will somehow follow you up there and then somehow dig into the plastic and, and sprout up and just there's no escaping it. Though you can avoid all of this by just going in at night, I find it more useful to, to take this approach because then you have more time that you can actually be in the sandbox and you can see things better and, and so forth. But regardless of which approach you take, an absolute necessity is to obtain the black ant shovel. For this, you're going to need three black ant parts, two black ant mandibles, and one black ant head. These can be obtained by going into the black ant hill, which we did talk about in my video on how to get the oven and its recipes. After you have the shovel and have obtained antlion armor, or if you just elected to do this at night, you will find the recipe in the underwater chest in back of the sandcastle in the moat. This chest is locked though and requires a key. The key can be found around the yellow shovel that is sticking out of the middle section of the sandbox. Be careful to avoid burrowed antlions while messing around over here. You will be able to find the key most easily at the time 1520 in game, in the center of the shadow of the shovel handle. Now that you have the key, you can go and unlock the chest. Doing so will give you the waterlogged recipe which will unlock the salt morning star. In here you'll also find a milk molar. After you have the recipe, you just need the following to craft it. You need two salt globs, one gum nugget, and three sickly roly-poly parts. Salt globs can be found abundantly in antlion burrows, and if you don't have the recipe for those, you can find them in this video that I've done. Gum is found by harvesting gum like deposits and chewed up gum stuck places, and it's located at various locations uh, throughout the map, one of which is underneath the picnic table. Sickly roly-poly parts can be collected by killing roly-polies, and they're located over near the picnic table and the sandbox area. Well, that is all that I have for you. I hope that you can quickly find and begin using this weapon. For more informational videos, random moment gameplay, chilled live streams, and other variety content, please subscribe or check back in a bit. Peace.